Well, I'd like to thank everyone for coming out here on such a uh, warm and glusterous day. I'm Mark Gombaugh, and I represent Argus for uh, Marshall County Economic Development Corporation. So welcome to all. I'd like to welcome all our elected officials and the media, Mayor of Plymouth, Mark Center, let's see, I got pick Sean Charisse, attorney, Kevin Overmeyer, of course, Mike Delp. Mike Delp. I think I did it. Yeah, I'll get that. I'd like to thank the Argus Town Council for helping move this project forward, especially my wife, Suzanne, which I'm thinking this project probably would not have happened had she not been a little uh, bull about the thing. But I do appreciate her sort of keeping everything moving. I'd like to also thank Lake City Bank, Dale Kramer, Corey McLaren for helping with the financing of this project. Uh, we really appreciate that. Uh, Lake City's enjoyed them being a partner with us. Brian Breck, oh boy, I'm so sorry. Brackermeyer uh, with IMPA. I want to thank them for their contributions on helping this become a shovel-ready project. Marshall County Commissioners and Council Members, and we've got two commissioners here like I, I just mentioned. That's Kevin and Mike. North Fork Southern Railroad. We want to thank North Fork Southern. Uh, they've done a lot of work with us. Jerry's worked with them quite a bit, so if and when we need that spur that uh, we should have that uh, fairly ready. IEDC and regional development authorities for providing the lending of uh, the assistance of the 400,000 that actually gave us a jump start on this project. NIPSCO, which picked up a lot of the initial expense on hookups and things like that. That's Don Babcock, Diane Thalman, and Cindy Admave. I especially want to thank Majority Builders. They kept an open slot for us, so when we were ready for this shell building, they were ready to do the construction. They had a lot of other opportunities, but I really want to thank Rick and his team, uh, Shane Black, Blotkamp, and Joe. Joe, I've heard your name so many times, I still screw it up. Uh, it, Tenervia. Okay, thanks. <laughs> As our general contractors. Evan Markey uh, with Brian McMorrow. He's, our, he's the engineering firm. He got this thing all around. Joe DeSiria, the architect for the project. Ralph Booker, Marshall County plan director, was also very helpful in this. And then Chuck DeWitt, who has helped us along the way. He's got a lot more work to do as he uh, is busy inspect doing his inspecting duties. A little side note, I also thank Pam Davis and Nancy Tyree for sort of being in the background doing all the, uh, quote, dirty work. We appreciate that. With all of that said, uh, I would then like to introduce Dustin Johnson, President of the Town Council. All right, here we go. I'm not good with microphones. I'm good with my voice, but not microphones. All right. I want to thank you, Mark, for your opening remarks. Um, as you can tell by the list of people and organizations recognized, this is an impressive partnership. Thanks to all who helped to get us to this groundbreaking today, especially the Marshall County Economic Development Board of Directors, for their leadership and willingness to take out debt financing through Lake City Bank. This building will allow us to attract a new thriving business to our community in the near future. I'd like everyone to look out into this field, which will someday be the functioning industrial park. Imagine what it would look like to see four to five businesses operating every day, bringing new employees who will come here to work, live, and send their children to school in Argus. 
This all begins with the building soon to be constructed. It continues with the strong partners and leaders willing to develop and execute plans and continue to invest in Argus's future. Thank you to the past Argus Town Council members who had a vision and were willing to purchase these 80 acres, which cost over $600,000. And thank you to all the current Argus Town Council members who have moved this project forward and brought us to the point we are today. Now, I'd like to have Commissioner Overmeyer from the Marshall County come say a few words. Thank you, Dustin. This is a great day in Marshall County. Um, I've over the last three or four years, ever since Jerry Chavez has been here, I've seen the transformation between the cities and the towns in this county. It's become a partnership, and as Mark alluded to, with some uh, the mayor here and Sean, and we have a lot to be proud of here in Argus. And I'd like to thank the town of Argus for this endeavor. You guys did a great work. And with the new manufacturing center coming in, I hope to see new more buildings here in Marshall County. This is about the county, and over the last couple months, with the town of Culver getting their stellar designation and Argus, what you guys are doing today, it's a great day to be to be living in Marshall County. So, I'd like to thank the town of Argus. You guys, keep up the good work, and just to let you know, we're still working on J turns. <coughs> There is a meeting being held today with our state senator and NDOT Commissioner Joe McGinnis on these J-turns. So uh, our US 31 coalition board has not given up on interchanges. So we're going to continue to work for that. Bill Kramer, you're next. I'd just like to thank the town of Argus and the Marshall County Economic Development uh, for giving us the opportunity to partner with you all. Uh, there's my southern accent from southern Marshall County. <laughs> but uh, we are very pleased to help with this project and hope we were able to help with many more. I'd like to recognize Joe Kessie, senior uh, lender from Lake City Bank Commercial Department, and Corey McLaren. Uh, commercial lender from Lake City Bank and then back there is Kim Hooley our local uh, branch manager here in the town of Argus so uh, once again thank you very much and thank you Jerry for keeping us abreast of what's going on in March County you know I don't have a lot of uh, <coughs> many words to say but I would like to invite uh, our contractors elected officials, town council, Kevin, uh, and others, MCEDC, to come up with and turn over some dirt, make this thing official, and then we'll take some uh, questions from the media shortly after that. Two. Smile the cameras. Three. Turn. There you go. Congratulations, Argus. <laughs>